So now it's time for our last Excel problem for Chapter 7. We're going to be working on 7-4 number 13, which is right here. And this one actually has a data set. Mm -hmm. And it says, use a normal probability plot to assess whether the sample data could have come from a population that is normally distributed. Oof, what a mouthful. Okay, so let's go look at the data. Here it is right here. Um, you can highlight it. You're going to need your DDXL add-in because you can look here. Um, this it, The normal probability plot is not one of your options. So it's not going to be able to be constructed from um, Excel. Well, it could be constructed from Excel, but it would take a lot of work, like a lot of calculations. You'd have to make it by hand. So the quick way is just to use DDXL. And you're going to go to, let's think, hmm, charts and plots. That sounds good. Let's go there. Uh, click on charts and plots. Dot plot. Mm, no, no. Yes, there it is. The normal probability plot. That's the one. Click on that. Now notice I highlighted my data ahead of time. That's why I've got it right here. Um, that's something I always forget with ZDXL. You have to highlight the data that you want to use. So let me move it over there. This is my quantitative variable. I don't have a label variable, so I'm not going to worry about that. Notice down here it said the first row is a variable name. That's correct, right? My first row is a name. So say OK. And there it is. It opened it up. Look at that. Let me click on this window. Edit copy window. We go back here and right click and paste and there it is. I'm going to double click on it. If you double click it brings up the format window and you can change it and give it a picture border. Makes it look clearer. Alright, now it's said to assess whether or not this data was normally distributed. I'm going to have to say no. Now the reason being, look at these points. What you want to see is you want to see them kind of forming a line more or less. But this is kind of forming a curve going up and around. So I would say, mm -mm, nope. And let me add a text box to put this in. There we go. Um, no, the data is not normally distributed because the points do, well, are not even close I mean, to forming a line. Right? That's what you want to see. You want to see them kind of making a line. It's not going to be a great line, but this is way off. This this kind of curve thing. This is no good. All right. That's it. 7-4 is one of the easiest things we ever do. Uh, we are done with Chapter 7, and I will see you guys in, for Chapter 8 soon.